uh, hello friends and today we will know about ericsson 2g 3g 4g configuration okay and uh, again again i am saying that this video will help to fight interview if you are going to attend interview in ericsson so uh, that's why i am saying that uh, you can watch full video then you you will understand everything okay so let's continue this is our ericsson basement 6630 uh, it support 2g 3g and uh, 4g and 5g also but uh, uh, in this video we will learn uh, only 2g and 3g 4g configuration so we will know about uh, this uh, hardware and and connection this is first sector and we are using combo antenna and combo antenna has uh, uh, six port you can see in this video okay and rt port also there here we can connect rt uh, and uh, rt we can connect from here to our radio okay uh, three comma triple band uh, three course comma triple band here you can see i mean say this is three sector site and here we are going to use three comma uh, antenna okay This is our RRU. We are going to use a three RRU in each sector. So we have three sectors. So we need to use nine RRU. Here we have a power plant. Okay, we have to give power from here, from uh, here to RRU and our uh, basement. And uh, this is power cable. We are um, we are uh, connecting power cable from rectifier to radio i mean power plant to radio we have to use 20 ampere mcb uh, as per uh, ericsson standard and this is for power cable for uh, bb6630 here we need to use 10 ampere mcb for double uh, 6630 this is a standard we are using one double 6630 we are using three uh, radio 2219 it support 1800 and um, we are also using three radio 2217 it support 800 and we are also using three radio 2212 it's about 2600 so 80, 1800 we are using for 3g technology and 2217 800 we are using for 2g and 2212 2600 we are using for lte means 4g purpose okay so here we, we need to connect the jumper uh, from radio to antenna so we have a two port in radio so we, uh, we have to connect two port from radio to antenna this is our RAT cable so RAT cable connecting in this radio because this radio support 1800 as uh, you can see here radio 2219 v3 1800 here this is for 2217 v20 800 for 2g technology and this is for radio 2212 b7 2600 for lt technology okay now you have you have to uh, give connection from basement to uh, radio so you need to connect to optical cable so this is your optical cable you can see also fiber uh, you need to use each cable in each radio so you can see here so we have um, in first sector you can see here in first sector we have three radios so we need three optical cable or fiber cable to connect from basement to radio for second sector also we need three and for third sector also we need three okay uh, this was for first sector and this is for second sector and this is for third sector we are using 16 ampere and 16 ampere and 20 ampere we are using 16 16 ampere for 2212 b7 i mean uh, 2600 16 ampere we are using 2217 b20 means 18 800 and 2219 we are using uh, for 20 ampere uh, for 1800 band okay so this is uh, i mean a standard uh, uh, mcb uh, which we can use for this radio okay 
this is for second sector or be, because we, we are going to install also second sector so we need to is three rru in that sector so we have um, we are giving connect, uh, we are giving connection from here and this is for third sector total uh, so we have three sector total we need to install three uh, per sector three radio so total uh, we have nine radio we have which we can install on tower okay this is laptop uh, we can log in from lmp port you can see connection you can uh, log in from here lmt lmt has two port lmt a lmt b you can log in from lmt a okay login port from lmt this is your gps antenna you can sync gps from here okay gps antenna and also uh, we have mini link double six double zero so you can you can connect here mini link here and this is media cable you can see and mini link double six double zero uh, login cable you can see from example given here you can uh, identify cable from here this is jump for cable and this is ret cable this is power cable this is fiber cable and this is media cable now we have also second sector you can see here and now we have third sector so guys i was telling about a uh, connection of 2g 3g 4g connection and Again, I am, I am saying that this video will help to fight interview. If you're going to attend any interview for Ericsson, so they will ask about this, how we can give connection if we have 2G, 3G and 4G technology on site. So see, you can say uh, we, we need three combined antenna, okay, which support uh, a plan technology, whatever technology uh, uh, has been planned on site. And um, and how many comba we need uh, depends on also sector. If, if, you, if you have one sector then you have to use only one comba if you have two then you can use two if you have three you can use three and also rru also you need see this is this is first sector in, in first sector we are using three radio so if we have two sector then we will use six if we have three sector then we can use nine radio so if we have the th uh, three sector configuration then we will use one double six three zero you can see here uh, um, uh, um, I mean hardware uh, uh, hardware uh, details here. One uh, double, uh, double six three zero we are using for this side, and three two two one nine which support eighteen hundred, and three radio two two one seven which support eight hundred, and three radio two two one two which support twenty six hundred. And also they will ask about MCB. Okay, what type MCB we are using for basement, and what type we are using for two two one nine and two two one seven and two two one two. So you can you can say this is Ericsson standard MCB which can we can use for uh, these are radio okay and basement also. And now you can also know uh, already I told in last video okay. So you need to know about details of port okay which port we are using for which purpose. So here you can see this is our transmission port and this is idle idle port we can sync from basement to basement if we if we have. Uh, two basement on site and this these are uh, these are optical port so total we have 15 optical port you can see in this section five optical port is there so we have three section so total 15 optical port is there okay tnc and tnd also this is sync uh, syncable we can sync from uh, one base uh, one basement to another basement we have also sync uh, port we can sync a gps from this port lmt port here we have so we can log in uh, lmt uh, we can uh, log in uh, basement from LMT port. Also, we have alarm port, so we can give alarm to rectifier. Okay, so these are details given. I hope this video also uh, will help uh, to fight interview. Again, I'm saying, okay. And guys, if you like this video, then you can subscribe my my channel. If you want to ask anything, you can ask in my comment. Okay, thank you, guys. Bye bye.